how to do equation typing in Google Docs. It is too much easy to typing equations uh, and you can uh, do lots of lots uh, complicated and hard type of the mathematics equation typing in Google Docs. It is too much easy and simple. Today in this video I am going to teach you all the things which you should to know if you are trying to uh, try the mathematics uh, equations. So without any lead, let's begin our tutorial. So first of all, I'm going to click in the new and just in the document and now Google Docs is creating a document and I'm just giving the name it uh, equation typing is the file name. Okay, so now you can see if I click here, so now you can see uh, there is one option that is equation. Okay, so from the equation, so now you can see you will get various type of the symbols available here okay so you will get a different types of the structure also available here so guys in this video i'm going to teach you to create mathematics equation and you will be also able to create different type of the mathematics equations in google docs okay so it is too much easy and simple so let's start so first of all i'm going to turn on the bullet from here our checklist okay so this is the checklist after that just you have to click in the insert and just you have to click in the equation to create mathematics equation in Google Docs then after that I, you have to uh, use this type of the structure uh, this panel will open inside uh, the Google Docs okay so there are various type of the symbols available okay and you can use different type of, of the structures also from here okay so first of all I am just going to use this type of the equation okay so i think i should to use this type of the structure here yeah so in this time i am just using a bracket here and i am just typing x plus a and the power is n okay so in this way you, you can use this one okay now after that you can use another type of the structure here so i think i should to use this type of the structure here okay so first of all i am just going to use a different type of the symbols here okay so i am just going to use this type of symbol so in the top side i am just going to type this one okay in the bottom side i am just going to type k is called to zero okay k is called to zero yeah and in this in this side i am just going to use a bracket okay so where is the bracket yeah here is the bracket and you you can type another type of the things here okay so i think i should to use a different type of the symbols here okay so in this way you can easily type different type of the things here uh, yeah like that okay then after that i am just going to delete this one okay so i'm just going to use another uh, power here like this and i'm just going x and the power is k so in this side i'm just going to use another this type of the structure i'm just going to a and this is n minus k okay so in this way you can easily type the equation and i'm uh, creating another equation that is okay insert sorry just you have to click in the new equation and just you can choose this type of the option here so a and the power is 2 and just you have to click in a little bit down okay then after that you have to uh, press minus again I am just using this type of the option x sorry b and the power is 2 and in this way I'm just pressing is call to a plus b a minus b yeah in this way you can use this type of the bracket okay yeah like that and I am just going to create another type of the equation here so first of all I am just going to click in the new equation 
and I am just using again that type of the structure here first of all I am just going to use a bracket here and I am just going to uh, type 1 plus x in the power sorry this is 1 plus x power n and in this side you have to type this call to and I'm just typing 1 plus and you have to type this type of the structure I'm just using this one okay so I am just typing n x and in this side I'm just typing 1 yeah, like that and I'm typing plus now again I'm using that type of the structure and I'm typing in bracket n minus uh, 1 and I am just using this type of the structure and just giving x and the power is 2 ok and in this side I am just typing 2 this type of the things ok and here I am just going to plus dot 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 ok so in this side I am just creating another type of the equation ok so for example I am just going to click on the insert new equation so I am just going to use this one okay so I am just giving the power e and, okay e and I am just clicking in the above and just giving x so now I am pressing it's called to and I am just giving 1 plus and I am using this type of the structure 1 and again clicking down and 1 is 2 like that and clicking the plus and clicking here again and just giving this type of the structure okay so I am just creating different type of the mathematics structure here so in the above again I am just using another type of the structure here so just going here and just clicking here so I am just giving this type of the structure like that and I'm just clicking here to and this type of the symbol okay again I am just clicking plus and again using that type of the structure okay yeah like that so I'm just using plus and I'm again using that type of the structure and I'm just giving uh, okay X sorry I am using this type of structure first thing x and the power is cube and I am just using 3 not ok so I am just giving plus dot 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 ok and in this way you, you can easily use this type of symbol so again I am pressing minus ok so now I can use the infinity type of the symbol so I think there should be the different type of the symbol like this and I am just using this one x x again I am using infinitive here yeah like this in this way you can also easily create uh, your uh, equation in Google Docs okay hoping that you get a few ideas to create mathematics equation in Google Docs if you have still any kind of confusion let me know in the comment section uh, and share this video to among the people who are trying to create mathematics equation in google docs i'll make another new video until that goodbye see you again